Hi, welcome back. I'm Vadim. I'm an IT specialist here at Nagios. In this video series, we'll be looking at scheduled reports. This allows administrators to view real-time information about different hosts and service groups. Users could schedule the delivery of XI client statuses as a PDF, JPEG, or CVS attachments via email on a recurring basis. When using Nagios XI, you can set scheduled reports that can show host status, temperature, utilization, storage, and more. Let's jump right in. When we just load Nagios XI, on the top side, we'll see reports. We will click on it. On the top side, we'll see the period or how long to report. We'll do yesterday. We can limit to hosts, host groups, and service groups. For today, we'll limit to local host. And you could select specific services, but we'll do all services. After that is done, you will want to click run, and you will see a local host report. On the top right hand side, you'll see a little clock icon that says schedule this report. We will click here and rename this to local hosts report. We will want to do daily and we want this to send over at 9 a.m. We will leave this as default. And for our instance, we just want a PDF. The recipients are the people that are going to be receiving the email. We'll keep this for my email. The subject line, we could change to local host report. And we could write in a custom message saying, have a good day. At the end, we'll click Save. And now we see that the local host report has been created. And there's other templates that you could use on the top side, as well as the history of reports being sent out. If you'd like to delete a scheduled report, click the Delete icon to remove it. And if you'd like to send it right now, click the button to Send Now. We can see here that it has sent the report with a link as well as the subject and the message to have a good day. I hope this video has helped you understand more about using scheduled reports and to get host and service statuses from your local network. Stick around for the next one.